I have to say that I am the only person to be banned from the conference karaoke. And it's mainly because one year I went and after the karaoke, I went out after it. And then I came into conference, so I woke up, oh my God, where am I? Oh, I'm in Aberdeen, what am I in Aberdeen for? Oh, it's conference. Oh, right, I better get to the prep meeting. So I went to the conference prep meeting, I went in, and the first minister saw me, and she said, you are stinking of alcohol. I went, yep. She said, no, Derek, you're absolutely reeking. I said, yep, you want to know the first minister? You want to know the truth? I think I'm still drunk. And she said, you're going to chair conference in that state? And I went, yep, and nobody will notice a thing. And nobody noticed a thing unless you were on the stage and you were intoxicated from the fumes oozing out of my body. So I was banned from the conference karaoke for as long as I was a business convener. And I'm no longer a business convener, so my singing career is coming back tonight. Uh, I'm not going tonight because I've got media in the morning, so I'm going to be very responsible.